guys, Al here. So today's video is brought to you especially by 0.8 Al Malaysia and also Anlab. So um, Anlab and 0.8 Malaysia was so nice. They actually sent me a product to review. I'm sorry, I will be probably be looking at my phone because uh, I did get a brochure of the product, but it's in Korean and I can't read Hangul, so. Yeah, uh, so online there's actually information in English, so I'll be referring to the information here, okay? So the product that I got to review is the Enlap uh, Xylitol Mild Sun Cushion. So basically it's like a sunscreen in a cushion form, which makes it really convenient and easy. Like you can just slap on that SPF wherever you go. And so that the harmful UV rays won't affect you. UV rays are like everywhere. It's not just under the sun. Even my lighting has UV rays. Basically everything around you, even your light from your phone has UV rays. So yeah. Basically it's very simple. It just looks like a pretty normal um, cushion. And then it comes with the puff. I really like the puff. Um, not too sure um, if they share companies or so, but the puff materials reminds me of uh, puffs that are from uh, Amo Pacific brands like Innisfree, uh, Laneige, or uh, Etude House. Yeah, it has that same type of consistency. I really like it. And this is what the sunscreen looks like, just something nice and white there. I've tested the sunscreen and I really like it. It absorbs very well into the skin. It doesn't leave like this sticky residue feeling. And if you're someone who doesn't like a uh, sunscreen smell, don't worry. It is very, very, very mild sunscreen smell. And um, that's why that you won't really get it on your hands because you have to pop. So I'm just gonna like push it down and show you guys. So. In. As you can see, it leaves like this moisture on you, but it absorbs very quickly into the skin and it doesn't feel like sticky or anything like that at all. Um, not very, very tan, but I will try to put on like the tannest part of me to um, show the white cast. As you can see, it kind of like has a glow and all. I did sort of test it on my boyfriend who's much, much tanner than me. It did sort of leave like a white look on him. Like his skin was like suddenly very bright one side. So um, if you are like a little bit more tan, I would recommend that you put this sunscreen probably like under makeup or really, really try to blend it out as much as um possible but overall it's a really great sunscreen I like it it has SPF 50 plus and PA triple plus smells good absorbs great into the skin very easy to cleanse off at the end of the day as well and I'm gonna read the information um, to you guys from the site over the ingredients that are inside it actually so it's called xylitol because it comes with the ingredient called xylitol so basically xylitol is uh, extracted from birch trees and it helps to calm damaged skin and it also has a low molecular high hyaluronic acid and biomimetic water so it actually increases your water holding capacity so you won't feel dry and sticky. Um, it has a butyl avocadate. So it helps to control your excessive sebum to keep your oil and water balance on skin because come on, nobody wants like an oily sticky feeling mixed together with sunscreen. And it has a SOS oriented medicinal formula. But trust me, it doesn't smell like medicine, it smells like those eastern herb shop kind of smell. It smells nice actually. So it actually reinforces the skin barrier from external environment and it has Niacinamide and adenosine, it helps to improve your wrinkles and contains uh, 
brightening. They put here whitening, but usually means brightening uh, functional ingredients, so it can help to smooth out your pigmentations and all. So yeah, let me see what other information is that. Okay, so the color is pure white as you saw just now, and the scent is like soft and powdery. Um, for me, the scent smelled like. Um, you know like those sunscreen that you used to use when you go to the beach or go to the pool as a child? Yeah, it smells like that but a milder version of it. So if you're someone who's irritated by scents, trust me, this won't irritate you because I am very very sensitive to fragrance so this is good. And the texture is like a milky emulsion type which is true and the feeling is moisturizing and matte. Which is true because it feels so nice to the touch and yet it doesn't feel dry. I, I don't know how... how how it works that way but it, it's so good and um, NZAP actually got a certification on this product as well so it's certified as a functional cosmetics and they got it from the Ministry of Food and Drug Safety in Korea so the sunscreening wrinkle cam um, whitening uh, aka brightening triple function is actually approved and then uh, skin irritation test completed as non-irritating so the product has actually passed like a strict skin irritation test. So rest assured, you guys will be okay with this. So yes, let me see what else I can tell you guys about it. Okay, that's about it for the information that is on the site. Oh yeah, another thing is that you guys know I love Edward Avila and apparently according to the site, it is actually Edward's pick item. I'm like so happy I have something that Edward approves. I usually get a lot of things that Joan approves but yes, this was approved by Edward so yeah, check it out and I approve it too. Um, so far the sunscreens that I've used are any three sunscreens but I really really like this one. It's so easy to just toss into the bag because Sometimes I do forget to pack some skincare um, over to the boyfriend's place and this over last weekend I forgot to pack my sunscreen so this kind of saved my SPFness because this was in my bag since I just got sent the product so I was like hey great chance to try it and uh, even my boyfriend says that it matches very well on my skin he couldn't even tell that I had sunscreen on that's how good this thing is and thank you so much and lab it was so sweet to send me some samples as well ah uh, you guys are so 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 sweet okay so they sent me a uh, hey Hyrule Syrian moisture cream a Mela Vita whitening cream and also a xylitol mild sun gel so this is kind of like um they are lying together for their sun care product so yeah my rating on this i would give it a 9 out of 10 minus one mark because uh, it is a little bit pricey for a sunscreen cushion um because it's not like a full bottle or anything like that i checked on their site and it's about uh close to twenty five thousand won which is about close to, I think, 25 USD. So it is a little bit on the high side. Because um, I'm so used to getting sunscreen from Ministry that don't cost that much. Um, but yeah, it is a really, really great product, very convenient. And the, um, so that's minus like 0 0.5 marks. The other 0 0.5 marks is uh, because it's not very easily accessible to, to get this uh, product. I've tried searching online and the sites that I've found that uh, do ship this item is uh, G Market and uh, 11th Street. I'm not too sure if their site itself actually ships overseas because uh, pretty much everything is in Korean for the shopping part, I believe. But I will leave like their links in the description box below and you can contact them for uh, further details. So thank you again at Lab and 0.8 um, Leisure for sending me the item to review. I really enjoyed it. So yeah, if you guys uh, like this video, give it a thumbs up. Okay, like it. So don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys again in the next video. Bye!